It's week nine of the SCAC Men's Soccer Player of the Week selections. I'm Rachel Gibbon with Colorado College's Theo Hooker, our Men's Soccer Defensive Player of the Week. Thanks for joining me today. Rachel, thanks for having me. Theo, I've lost count on how many Player of the Week honors you've gotten this whole season. How does it feel to be honored so much for your hard work? Um, personally, uh, it's obviously great to get the recognition, but again, it's more of a testament to the guys in front of me um, who do a lot of work to make me look good. Sure. Let's talk a little bit about last weekend. You stopped 15 of 16 shots in the Tigers' two huge games that weekend against Dallas and number 23, Mary, Mary Harden Baylor. What kind of pressure did you face in those games and how did you overcome it? Um, I think both, both games were high intensity, high stakes game. Um, obviously at Dallas, um, fighting not really for conference positioning, but um, building into the tournament, momentum was huge. Um, and at Mary Harden Baylor, obviously a big in-region ranking game. So both, both games, both teams in both situations, um, obviously going at it full steam, so immense pressure on both sides of the ball. Um, but we, as a team, just came together and got our mentality right. You know, we might, you know, we might hurt through after this game, but we're going to come off the field leaving it everything out there. Sure. And looking ahead, the Tigers are in the number three seed for the SEAC postseason tournament. You guys play the quarterfinal game against Southwestern. So what's the game plan? Um, right now, just taking it one game at a time. So, you know, what we've been doing during the season has given us success in the past, so you know, focusing on those things, fine-tuning them this over this week, and um, hitting Friday with all, everything we have. Well, thanks for talking soccer with me. We're going to move into this new game I have called Would You Rather, where I ask you some questions and you tell me which one you would rather have or do. You ready? All right. Would you rather win one thousand dollars now or ten thousand dollars in ten years? Um. I'll do $1,000 now. Okay. And would you rather lose your keys or your phone? Definitely my phone. And do you think you could live without music or would you rather live without Netflix? Uh, I think I'd live without Netflix. Sure. And last one, would you rather speak to animals or be able to speak all the languages in the world? Oh, definitely animals. Sure. <laughs> Well, thank you so much for sitting down and talking with me, Theo, and congrats again on your honor this week. Thank you, Rachel. Thanks for having me.